all these things translate into huge opportunities in the commodity markets next year. Because if grains can't be produced at the level they're supposed to be, and they don't meet their yield, how much they're able to harvest, that means there's going to be less food going into the grocery store. That means what? The supply, the real supply, will be small, very, very low. What's that going to do for prices? Hyperinflation through the roof, supply and demand. So if that's happening or likely to happen, wouldn't it be interesting for you to start studying what those grain markets are doing over the next six to nine months? Because I believe that we're going to see enormous bull markets in the grain markets in 2023. Like straight up, never been seen before type of moves. And they've laid the groundwork for it because they know everybody's looking for crypto bull markets. Everybody wants the stock market to turn around. 